Good morning, boys and girls, and welcome to Shen Plays. I'm your host, Shenner, and today we're playing Granada here in the Open Rivers Alice 4. Atze is not annexing Benz, and we were watching Karakoinu invade the Ottomans, which is just hilarious, because the Ottomans declared war on Karakoinu, but they're not fighting at all. They're just they're just letting Karakoinu invade them. I don't understand. Something is definitely wrong with the AI. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but they're just not doing anything. They have 300,000 units, and they're not using them. The Ottomans will cede Sharazor and Mosul to Karakoinu. Ottomans will release Bulgaria and Trapsund. Really? You made them release Bulgaria? Oh my god. <laughs> really? I mean, it's just two provinces. It's nine base tax. But come on, copper and iron? That's, that's pretty impressive. And Trapsund. Is it a Sunni Bulgaria? No, it's an, it's an Orthodox Bulgaria. All right. I thought it would have been a Sunni Bulgaria. I guess not. Uh, but yeah, Karakonu won that war without lifting a finger, really. The Ottomans just never fought them. But yeah, now we can go to war with them for those two provinces. If we could get a fucking CB. Uh, give me a CB. You want a loan? They do want a loan. But uh, we have them as a rival. Okay, we can unrival you. That's fine. Look, you're not a rival. See? Cancel loan. Best CB. You know it. Ooh, tech up time. Yep. And we can build a university now, which makes cheaper tech for the rest of the game. Ooh. Oh, I want that, baby. I want it. I want it. I want it willingly. All right, come on then. Let me give you a loan. So I'm going to invade your dumb ass. There you go. 24 ducats. You are a cheap date, car coin Lou. Ha <laughs> ha. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Big war. Big war. Whoa. What is this? Austria versus a lot of stuff. Well, granted, it's Austria, Hungary, and Brandenburg, which are the three largest states here in Central Europe, versus Trier and Bavaria, which, I don't know. Trier and Bavaria are pretty potent, too. Everyone's the same tech. I don't know. I don't know who would win that. I really don't know. Yes, let us guarantee the Ottomans. Why not? Why not? What could what could go wrong, right? And uh should guarantee Russia, but they won't take an alliance anyway, so it doesn't really matter. I mean, we're pretty far away from an alliance right now. Darn it. Are we still going to get an Osmanli? Yes, we are. Oh, come on. I just need my, my king to die so we can get an Osmanli on the throne. I would love an Osmanli on the throne. Ah, oh, that'd be brilliant. That would be brilliant. All right, go ahead and break the loan. Oh, are these Patriot Rebels? Please tell me these are Patriot Rebels. They are Persian Patriots. Oh, fantastic. Go Persian Patriots. Yes. Great. If they could flip that land, we could just annex Persia, you know? Come on, break the loan. I know you want to. <laughs> okay, relations, please. Russia's having no trouble with that war. Oh man, the Ottomans have negative prestige. Give me their dynasty. Give their dynasty. Please give me their dynasty. <laughs> uh, lose admin points or lose prestige. Lose the admin points. Oh, give me the dynasty. Come on, die. How old are you? 57? He's 57. Just die. Just die. Oh, oh. <gasps> Russia's improving relations with us? Now we're talking friendly. 
friendly. Oh, he wants an alliance. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, yeah. Oh, I can't do it while we hate him. Don't worry, we won't hate him very long. He's actively improving relations with us. This is amazing. Russia, I, I don't know how to say this, but I think I love you. Let me guarantee you. I think I love you. This will piss off the Ottomans a bit, but not my problem. Oh, there it is. Yeah. Oh. Oh, man, I can't believe it. We have an alliance with Russia. Oh, oh that felt good. And of course, the Ottomans are upset that we're allied to their rival, but at the end of the day, we have an alliance with Russia. Did I mention that we have an alliance with Russia? I think it's time to mention that we have an alliance with Russia. Wow. Oh, I have a big smile on my face now. So, uh, Russia, would you like to join me in a war against Portugal? Um, no. Russia and the Ottomans both will not join us. Fuck. Damn it. What's the point of an alliance if you won't join me in a war? Fuck. Ah. <laughs> God damn it. Oh, we can tech up. Uh, let's tech up. Alright, we are now tech 20, just like everyone else. Yeah, everyone's tech 20. So we're right there with the Joneses. And these Persian patriots are doing a number over here on the Timurids, so that's nice. can we do? Uh, get relations up, obviously. Keep them super keen. I love that. He's gone friendly for some fucking reason. I don't know. I don't even know. I don't even care. Just keep him super happy. That's all I want. Give him military access. Oh, yeah. It's going to be fucking great. Hundred and twenty-two. Not bad. Not bad. As long as we don't share a border, we're good. Will my king please die? <laughs> oh. Ah, uh, don't, don't do any buildings yet. I want my university and I want my war college. So no buildings until we get those. King, please die. Sultan. Sultan Muhammad the 15th. Please. You're 58. Just die. There we go. Canceled loan. Nice. Nice. Canceled loan. You with your no allies time for war. I'll just let my vassal invade you. I don't have to do this. No one wants to join me anyway, so whatever. You guys do the inv- I'm just gonna sit back and, um, put my feet up. Oh, I can use- I can use my sultan. Yeah. Sultan. Yes, Muhammad. Let's go. Let's go, Muhammad. You and me, bro. 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 Korea is westernizing. Really? Oh, off of Castile. Right. That's okay. Go Korea. Go Korea. It's your birthday. Oh my goodness. I can't believe we're allied to Russia. That's awesome. That is just awesome. And these Persian patriots might succeed, because uh, the Ottomans have no way to get in there. At least not at the moment. Persia is not giving access to anyone, so the Ottomans cannot kill these rebels. Good, 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 good. Hopefully they'll find a way to get over here to Esfahan and Yazd, but most likely they're just going to still chill for some... I don't know, I wish they would come down here as well, but they won't. Uh, Ottomans, can we do anything to make you happier? I would love you to be, like, super duper happy. God, we're going to get the Ottomans dynasty. Please die. Oh shit, no, the Persians are killing them. I want to do it. I want my king to die. Shoot. 
Fuck Persia. Dick. I wonder why Russia went friendly all of a sudden. Like, what changed to make him say, oh, okay, I guess we should be allies or something? And why are you guys not invading? Go invade. Come on. What are you doing? Just invade. Come on. Who knows? Okay, go relations with them. Why not? Oman's pretty good, but you might as well top them off. Uh, sure, top off the Ottomans, whatever. And, uh, no, we're pretty good. Get some more claims, I guess? Let's get some more claims. Fabricate claim, let's go for Cadiz, why not? What could go wrong, right? Get some claims. I don't know why my vassals are just chilling here. They are seriously just chilling in friendly territory instead of invading. I don't know. I don't pretend to understand my vassals. Maybe they have the same problem that the Ottomans did. Maybe they maybe there's a bad pathing algorithm and they can't find the way uh, to Karakoinlu. And they're asking everyone they know, does anyone know the way to Karakoinlu? And everyone's like, what? No one knows how to get to Karakoinu. It's a mystery. Come on, King, please die. Oh, he didn't die. Fuck. Why didn't you die, King? Sultan? Damn it. Uh-oh, Russia is no longer friendly. Now they're cordial. What changed? Game, will you please tell me why they changed? Why are they cordial instead of friendly? Fuck. And yeah, I wish these Patriot Rebels would go to Esfahan. They're just not doing it. <laughs> they're not doing it. Oh well. So Russia, you interested in a war with Portugal? Say yes, say yes, say yes, say yes. Ottomans are, but not Russia. What about a war with Castile? No, Russia doesn't want any wars. Why not? Do you have a truce? No. Oh, he's already at war with France. That's why he doesn't want a war. Are you invading France? Like, did you actually send any Russian soldiers over here? Because it looks like the answer is no. No, no, you didn't. Damn it. You just blockading them or something? What's causing the war score? Let's see. He's got 24 war score for owning the target province. Ah, yes, all of the colonies are invaded. Ah, so the new world's getting completely invaded. That's what's going on. There you go. Yep. Russia, Brazil. Yep. So Russia's invading all of France's colonies. That's what's going on. Not worth very much, but it's something, right? It is something. Can my sultan please die now? Please, I want that dynasty so badly. All right, get some claims. Let's get some more claims. Let's get a claim on, um, what can we claim? Algarve. Yeah, go claim Algarve. Why not? I don't really want the Northern Africa. I want Iberia. In fact, if Portugal wants to move his entire nation to North Africa, that'd be great. <laughs> I'll take Iberia off your hands, Portugal. Why not? Go Persian Patriots. Go Persian Patriots. Hmm. 
Hmm. I don't know. He's not friendly anymore. So he probably wouldn't take an alliance offer if we offered it today. But since we already have the alliance, he's willing to consider keeping it. It's kind of a weird situation right now. I really wish my sultan would die. He does have an increased chance of dying because he's a general. But that doesn't make him die. Lose piety. Yay, we lost some piety. Yay, we're lo losing piety like crazy. Actually, now that we're caught up in military tech, we might want to start gaining piety again. <laughs> we are actually six years ahead in military tech. Oh, that's a good feeling, man. Feels good, man. Let's get a claim on Andalusia. Yeah. Hot. Yes! Provinces are defecting to Persia! Yes! Now, Patriot Rebels, come over here. Go do these. Alright, yeah, all we really wanted here was to get those two, so... And he will. Okay, that's fine. I don't care about anything else. Yay, my vassal got bigger. But we could get bigger still if we could figure out a way to get these two from the Ottomans. And I really don't know how. Rebels, maybe? I don't know. Fifty-nine years old, and he's like, "Well, I guess I better stick it in this girl over here." God damn it! <sighs> Fuck. Yeah, that's bad. 59 years old. 60 now. Oh well. Let's go get some more claims on Portugal. You know, I don't even want these provinces. Oh, what's up, Aragon? Aragonese revolutionaries. Oh, he wants to be a noble republic. Isn't that cute? Can I get any claims on you? Nope. Darn it. Ah, change the culture of Gujarat. Oh, can we do our buildings now? Yes, we can. Get me that war call, or get me the university. That's a big one. Cheaper technologies everywhere. Uh, the University of, you know what? Put it in Central Dobe. I think I'm going to move my capital up there. And then next up will be the War College. Yes. Yearly Army Tradition. Very nice building. Oh my goodness. That sucks so many donkey penises. That really did. That really, really did suck donkey penis. Like a lot. Unfortunate. Very unfortunate that our king wound up having a little baby at 59 years old.
Alright, so let's see if anyone will join us in this war against Portugal. I hope the answer is yes. Uh, the Ottomans will, but Russia won't. I need Russia. Well, I want Russia. I think the reason they won't is they're busy in their current war. What about if we declare on Castile? Same thing. Russia won't. I really want Russia. Maybe what we should do is insult Portugal. Then Russia will join our defensive war. Let's do that. Let's insult both of these idiots. having babies at 59 years old. Damn it. Yay, more provinces defecting to my vassal. It'd be really cool if those rebels would come down here. But they don't want to. Hmm. Coffee delicious. Let's get relations up with Tripoli. I don't plan on being an ally of them, but once we integrate Omen, we're going to want to get all this land over here. So might as well integrate them. I mean, might as well get relations up with them. All we're doing over here is keeping... Um, these provinces from rebelling because Persia has a long task ahead of him converting all this land. He's Persia, my vassal, is Sunni, and a lot of these lands are Shiites. So he's converting everything for us. So that, that'll take him some time. Unfortunately, Iraq is Shiites, and Oman is also Shiites. Man, that really is a pain because we're going to have to convert all that shit. But that's okay. That's why we have religious ideas, right? Wow. I think if Russia was at peace right now, they'd be more willing to join my wars. When can you guys annex Bengal? I really don't know. I don't know how long it's been. It doesn't tell you. If it was a personal union, it would tell you how long they've been in the union. But if it's a vassal, they just don't tell you. Hmm. Oh well. Whoa! Uh, the Marathi Revolt. Crush the Hindu rebels. Gain 10 revolt risk. Wow. Or give in to their demands. Local autonomy for 50 years. Wow. 50 years. How long would the revolt risk last? Doesn't really say. I think I'm okay with the revolt risk. I don't want 50 years of lowered income. 50 years of lowered income, that's a lot. 50 is a lot! <laughs> uh, does that actually give us any revolt risk? It should. Well, no. Wow, we have an advisor, we have good tolerance, positive stability, perfect legitimacy. Yeah, there's no revolt risk. Even with plus 10 in Marathi province, there's still no revolt risk. Wow. That's pretty amazing. Okay, we finished our university, so techs are now 5% cheaper for the rest of the game. Ah, oh, that's beautiful. Beautiful. 
Come on, rebels, come on down here. Come on, Persian patriots, come down here. They're not doing it. They're not doing it. Oh well. There we go, Gielan defected. So all three of those provinces have defected to my vassal, that's fantastic. And I'm really hoping these guys will get some rebels, but there's no revolt risk at all. None. Thanks to AI bonuses. <laughs> Uh, why did I turn on AI bonuses? I don't know. Oh, we almost have enough money for our war college. Ooh, nice. Ah, fucking hell. Now we have, what, 14 years of regency? Yep. Why did I have to have a baby at 59 years old? Look at this. Right before he dies, he has a kid. Who the fuck does that? He's on his deathbed and he manages to get an erection. God damn it, can't you just die and give me the right dynasty? For fuck's sake. <sighs> oh well. Why don't we call that here? Thank you guys for joining me. I've been Shen, you've been you. The timing could not have been worse. Not only did we not get the right dynasty, but now we have 14 years of regency. Hooray! I'll see you guys next time.